So now I'm going to show you uh, how to use the heat gun to change the shape of your 3D printed object. So what we want to do here is we want to curve the octopus's legs just slightly around. This is a hair clip, so it's going to cover, it's going to be a bun cover eventually. So we're going to turn the printed work upside down. And let the heat gun warm up a little bit. And I'm using this on a cork surface, so we're not going to have any burning. Depending on the thickness of the piece, it will heat up slower or faster. And you want to make sure that you are not burning your fingers. So short bursts of heat. And then while it's cooling down, you just hold it with your fingers. See how that has curled up now. Oops, that has curled up now. And we're gonna try that with the other ones as well. Oh, and this one's curling up on its own. And you can make tiny adjustments this way. This is ABS plastic. I haven't worked a lot with heat guns and PLA, but I'm assuming it'll be a similar process. You could do this outside on the concrete as well. That might be a really safe place to, to do it. And as the heat gun warms up, it'll take less and less time to change each one of these. You could probably also use a pair of of gloves or something like that. Might work really well. Just a couple more. With um, 3D prints that have very thin pieces, the heat gun can be used to smooth the prints themselves. You have some little bits and rough pieces of filament, you can use it for that. Okay, I think I like the look of that. Just wanted to move this one a little bit more. I'll just hold it till it's cool. And then you have an octopus that looks more like an octopus and less like a 3D printed object. I think that'll look great as a hair accessory. And now you know what I know.